by now you've probably heard about the drought that's gripping South Africa at the moment, threatening rural and urban areas alike. Water shortages are no joke. But what if you could just make water out of thin air? We're in the midst of one of the worst droughts in living memory. Severe water restrictions are in place in Johannesburg. Durban is dry as a bone and Cape Town is not far behind. Residents have been asked to stop watering their gardens during the day to prevent evaporation, to take shorter showers and to reuse bath water. Now imagine if we could make water from thin air. Well, now we can aptly named Water From Air has developed a machine that can literally produce unlimited pure drinking water from just the humidity in the air. So what exactly is this machine? The Water From Air AW3 is a humidity and temperature driven machine that can produce up to 32 liters of pure water every 24 hours. The way that Water From Air is made is literally it's a cooling process. One can think of an air conditioner or the outside of a cold glass uh, that water that, that goes around the cold glass is literally from the air itself. So uh, as far as technology goes, there has to be uh, wind drawn or air drawn over a coil or a condenser. That cools it down and then that condensation drops down and then is processed through the sanitization and the filter process. Sounds too good to be true, right? There has to be a catch. Well, there kind of is. The machine depends on the level of humidity in the air and the temperature to produce water. If we have a humidity of less than 35%, the machines won't work. It doesn't make any water whatsoever. We've got a solution for that. There's an inlet in the back of the machine. Because the machine is all natural, it's ultraviolet filtration. Uh, there's no chlorine, no chemicals. And because of that, that same filtration process, it makes it almost like a puri uh, purification plant, as it were. The drought in our country has left farmers reeling in at least five of South Africa's nine provinces. While this machine is unlikely to help them, it could ensure that they have water to drink when the taps run dry. And with news out of places like the Northwest Province revealing dams are only carrying half of their normal capacities, that could be a real issue. There's a billion too many of us on the planet right now. This is the future, it's the present in fact, and it's being used throughout households in South Africa at the moment. What we need to do is have government come to, come to the party. A thousand of our larger machines, which is 1,500 or up to 1,500 litres per 24 hours, a thousand of those would give more drinking water than 2% of the population need. This machine definitely works, but you need some humidity to extract the water. It's also very expensive, with the cheapest option going for around 25,000 Rand plus fat. It's one way to ensure you always have some cool water at hand. And after all, every bit helps.